Hey guys, what's up? So two is your top best rated trees, 5 is 11, 12, 13, and 14. The first tree is called Neon Board, small and unfinished theme engine, made as an experiment. This tree is called Fly JBX. You can hide during jailbreak your eye device. There's basically a jail bypass jailbreak detection tweak. This tree is called Lithium Ion and uh, brings ultimate customization to your battery icon. This tweak is called Alkaline. And basically, tired of boring and looking at battery and status bar, spice up your theme and sound from the rest. This is a tweak for that. So you can see, change the battery and your icons. This is called Crash Reporter, and we use the details of crash to the possible cause of the crash. This is called SM Server, has the ability to send tap ads, leave text from behind a reverse proxy, and much more. So you can send text from your browser. This is called Pass By. Uh, fits Apple Watch and iOS 13 and 14, so open source speak gives you many password customization options, so pretty cool. Yes, you can bypass the passcode using the activator gesture, um, come to a specific Wi-Fi network or Bluetooth device within a certain time from your last lock or using headphones. This is called Wuzit Pro, and it's all-in-one tweak for a call identification solution for your device, so it's a perfect call ID solution for your device, so it helps you know, tell you who's calling you. Um, and who you're calling to. So also there's also another tweak is called Crazy Tets. It adds options to long press Tets menu. <coughs> Next tweak is called Libs um, or Lib SM Server. Support tweak for the SM Server app. Required to send Tets. The next tweak is called Scum uh, VM and allows you to run certain classic graphical point and click adventure games. This is called Icon Renamer. Quick and easy icon renaming from your home screen. One of my favorite tweets uh, called App Data. View and access application data uh, from a home screen. So you can clear cache, view the app bundle size, you can open up by Infraza. So pretty cool. And you also can re remove the uh, badges. This is called A Bypass and cannot be installed due to dependency error. So it's basically like a jailbreak detection bypass tweak. So this is the original source right here A Bypass. This tweak is called Milky Way 3 and with multi window side, I mean multi window mode, we shot each windows, minimize the windows, open its apps as window from 3D touch, pretty cool. This tweak is called Unico and set a video as your wallpaper on the watch screen, home screen, and control center. This tweak is called City of Updates. Um, City will not actually show all packages that are updated under these changes tab. This shows all packages up updates for tweaks you do not have installed, confirm it works. Press on my package and then hit change package settings to allow all, all updates should be turned on. This is called Lottie Status Bar. Lottie Animation is engine for your status bar. This is called LibGC Universal, a uh, universal library for tweet development. This is called Photos Pro. Add many features to the application um, of photos. Sports I was 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. This is called Battery Flow Reborn. It's uh, compatible with iOS 13 and 14. It allows you to completely customize the low, low power alerts um, version of battery flow that has been heavily written to work on the newest devices. This is called Libnebs, library con things commonly used in my tweets. This is called Only You, so with Only You, you can always have the, have the picture of your loved ones on your lock screen. This is called LS Contacts, uh, Contacts Bar right from your lock screen. This is called Switcher Style Pro, customize Switcher Style like iPad. It's called Translomatic, quickly translate any text. This is called Flow, uh, cover flow like never before. It's new for your music player. This is called Animation Speed Fast Plus, it speeds up your animations. This is called Anime or Anim Plus, it speeds up your animation as well. This is called Fake, uh, last three is called Fast Ads, speeds up animations. And the last three is called Fake Clock Up. Fake Clock Up accelerates UI kit translation animation. So, you guys, catch the next one.